afternoon, Thursday 4th, no, yeah, Thursday 4th, January 24th, I've just left up a Haukwa campsite. Let the suffering begin. I think I've gotten up onto the spur, done the little dozen or so zigzaggy curves, and um, yeah, should ease off a little bit in the stick. Pretty hot, um, humid, not much in the way of breeze either, so got to keep the water up, it's sweating a lot. Good morning, or oh, nearly afternoon, Saturday 2nd, March 24, and I'm finally getting out for another walk. Uh, anyway, I'm at the Cathedral State Park, going to try and do the Southern Circuit, which I think is about 10Ks, with a bit of steepness and scramblings. So given that I haven't done much exercise in the last two months, That'll be probably quite a challenge if it wouldn't have been where I fit. Definitely will be now. Anyway, see so how we go. Track's been pretty. Good. It's starting to get a little bit steeper. Don't know for how long. Didn't do a hell of a lot of research. So, still going along the messmate track. Rising, you know, not too steep, but enough to get you sweating. Or enough to get me sweating. I think you're getting close to Sugarloaf Staddle. Get occasional glimpses of Mount Sugarloaf. Just rising straight up to the side. So I'm feeling already. I haven't got to the hard part yet. Made it to him. Sugar life. That's where we came. We took about an hour and a half, so I guess even in my decrepit state wasn't too bad. A quick break, and now to find the track up. There's two tracks: there's a canyon track and Wells Cave. And the cave track is supposed to be ridiculously hard, and climbing out by a Razorback track went away. Sugarloaf Peak by Wells Cave. Yeah. All right, let's just go the other way. 650 meters and nearly 200 meters altitude gain. Starting to get a little bit steeper and possibly scrambly. And I can see there's a marker up there. So navigation's no problem. No, no this bit's a bit trickier. I just try and put my feet in uh, many different spots, but I just, my hands. I just couldn't get something that felt like I could hold on with the hands and then push up without just falling sideways. Maybe get, go up that way and across, but I tried and was feeling pretty sketchy. Oh well, struggled down or made it all the way back down to here. I nearly chucked a few times so I'm not feeling the best, but I just just passing through the saddle and see what they're saddling in. I thought just after I turned around someone offered to show me the way up that little tricky bit but you know, I wasn't up for it. I felt a bit sick actually. I only chucked on the way back down to the picnic area. Oh, well, I'm heading down the messmate track. Shouldn't be too hard. That's the end of the messmate track. Not much to report. Getting back towards the Cook's Mill campground. That was pretty. Um, uh, not an event at the end. Anyway, 
Gotta go be a walk in a little bit. That's good. Um, pretty bad not making it, but uh, that's it. Uh, good afternoon. It's what's it? Friday, twenty second March, twenty four. I'm just leaving. Um, uh, sort of near Lake Cobbler, and I'm um, heading towards Camp Creek for tonight. What is it here? The snake's killed another, has it? Keep moving. Uh, it's a uh, twin long, made it to Speck Road. Been going for about an hour and a half. It's started at four, it's now 5.30. Got about at least two more hours of daylight. Hopefully I can make Camp Creek by about then or just after. Hey, it's usually spare, try late. I saw some guys. This was coming up early, currently doing the Buller Huts thingy and um, They'd, um, what have they done? They'd, um, come from Craig's hut, so they must have went from that bull to Craig's hut or something. And they're going to come towards Max Springs tomorrow. This is my string flat. I keep moving on. Coming up to the can. For the track up, straight up, oh, up the side of Mac Communica. So I think I've got four days to go to Camp Creek, it's about 10 to 7. So I probably won't make it before it'll be dark. Or well, just on dark by the time I get there. Just dark, about 10 to 8. And it's Camp Creek. It's still flying just. <sighs> Trying to set up camp. See what tomorrow brings. I rolled my ankle last night and then I strapped her up for today and then I rolled her again a few hours back so it could be anything from fine to a balloon by the, in the morning. Oh, looks like we've got someone who wants to steal my food. Yeah. Cooking dinner down on this rock just away from the tent. And turned around for a minute and plus Possum came down and knocked it all over. But I don't think it's to his taste or it's too hot because he left. Now I'll have to cook dinner again. Morning. It's about 10 to 5. On Saturday, 23rd of March. Um, so I didn't sleep much at all. A couple of hours, very uncomfortable. I don't know if I'm coming out cold or something, but I just do not feel very good. Maybe it's just like sleeping, the shock of doing a hard walk, or a fairly hard walk. It's not doing much, but I don't have it in here. I keep got pushing up hills, so I'm going to head back to the car and oh well, good training walk, I guess. Mount Kunica track and we'll turn off. I think I've about just over an hour. Keep plodding along. Doesn't look like day. the sun's going to come up anytime soon. Oh, the sun's definitely up now. Back onto the cobbler track. That's the last of the rough and ready rocky speck track and, and freshly graded and whatever. Cobbler track. Should be easier. Yeah. I guess. Back near Lake Cobbler. Somewhere over the back there. Oh, oh. oh man. Made in one piece. It was a bit of a slog. Not feeling, still not feeling fantastic, but the legs are alright, so it's not like I overdid it and the legs just don't work or whatever. Just, I don't know, didn't sleep. I think I'm coming down or something. Oh well, I doubt this would be YouTube worthy, but I'll check it out when I get home. And if it is, it may see the light of day. So if that's the case, uh, well, that's it. 
I guess, bye. Morning, Saturday, 13th of April. Going for a walk down at the prom down a Roaring Meg. Huge amount of people around. It's like so different from when I normally go. But anyway, it's uh, been up for an hour. We're not far from Telegraph Junction. I'm with the mysterious Mr. J or He's just chilling, isn't he? I don't know, he's gonna move. Oh, morning. Saturday, 20th of April, 24. It's just gone 11 a.m. Sort of a slightly late start. I'm planning on taking a leisurely stroll up the northwest spur of Mount Feathertop. I'm sure it'll be nothing too taxing. Um, I'll hopefully I get there or get something interesting. My last few starts haven't really amounted to much. Last week was the only problem, but we turned back due to um, injury concerns. And a few weeks before that, I walked out to Camp Creek and was gonna do more walking the next day, but slept like a crap, slept like just terrible. And um, yeah, didn't feel it, so I headed back. I uh, did see a possum who ate, stole my noodle, so that was cute. Um, before that I tried a little day trip up the Cathedral Ranges but didn't quite top out so yeah I'll go back there one day I guess and um, yeah before that just never got out so hopefully this will be the first video for the year I'm crapping on so I'll just keep walking um, yeah I don't think I need to cross here I think I know I can see a little red Red um, marker there, so we head away from the creek a little bit. A oh, marker, and yeah. I'm not going walking across that. <laughs> yeah, it's only get the tootsies wet. Looks so, like there's a crossing just a little bit further along the creek than the log. Uh, whatever. Got some a bit of blackberry action here. I don't know how often this track's used. We're above Stony Creek now. Right. I think this is a little close to the last crossing of the creek and we actually get onto the northwest spur. That was a sharp little climb and then steeply down. A little bit rusty. Now, a bit rusty. Not quite in shape or what those were shaped being in shape. I've done a bit of walking. Now it's time to start climbing, I think. We're gonna do some zigzags or whatever in a second. 
and it's steep. And it's definitely steep in places on these zigzags. Oh, I'm out of shape. Still going up. Not quite on top of the spur yet. Starting to get a little bit of views from time to time. Still going up. I think I might be walking the slowest in recorded history. Very slow. Get a nice view of the ovens of the ovens belly, I think. Uh, so I've given up. I don't know if it's this how steep this hill is, whether I'm just got something coming down for something or I'm really unfit or all the above. Uh, it's taking forever and I'm really feeling crap. So oh, one day I'll get somewhere to break. There's a creek, I don't know if you can see on that bar there. Um, all this steam coming off me. That's <laughs> uh, nice and cool here. The one more little hard bit to do is up and over a bump and then it's downhill, it's steep, and then I think after that it's pretty good. Oh, I have to crap. Oh, okay. A bit of a walk in, but it's a long ride just for a bit of a walk. Uh, Alright, that's it. Stay quick. 